Um, this game, I saw you could be a good game in the long house week. And Fortnite could have lost you. And, um, against Tennessee Tech, that probably, I mean, will be the one for you guys. I'm not a fan. Against Iowa. I mean, Iowa. Sometimes. You could actually beat them. I can um honestly. And that would be a good game um against BYU. I don't know. <laughs> BYU sometimes are good or sometimes bad. Against Maryland. I don't know. They're gonna be better this year. Maryland. Against Wisconsin. No, that, that, that's going to be a good game. Transitioning, I don't know, it's going to be a little... I mean, you could blow up them, because they have a little quarterback. It's Illinois. It's going to be a low scoring match right now, because Illinois have a good defense. I mean, as Michigan State, I mean, they could be bad. Michigan could be good, but I'm against Purdue. Should be a good game. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, Purdue will put up points, but you guys, you guys probably will put up more points. No, I'm just No, I'm not making a prediction. I'm just saying probability. I'm going to start the Western. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be honest with you. Why not right now? And Nebraska. They might be better this year, but I don't know. Best case scenario. You beat FAU. You beat Tennessee Tech. You beat Iowa. You beat BYU. You beat Maryland. I don't think you can really beat Wisconsin, in my opinion. So you went to Wisconsin. You beat Michigan. You beat Illinois. You beat Michigan State. You beat Purdue. You beat Northwestern and you beat Nebraska, so I think at best 11 to 1. So at worst, um, you beat FAU, beat Tennessee Tech, lose to Iowa, beat BYU, beat Maryland, lose to Wisconsin, lose to Michigan, lose to Illinois, lose to Michigan State. Beat Purdue. Beat North Boston and Mr. Nebraska. So let me tell you a few. Alright, so at best, 11 and 1. Worst, 6 and 6. I was scheduled for you to see you guys next week. Probably will be tonight.